We are on the magic lamp quest and we've got a puzzle to solve here. So we're still with Kira Met, and I do quite like her, she's pretty charismatic and she's there. Uh, she's damn fine. <laughs> okay. Right, what we need to do is we need to listen to the thing again. What was that inscription again? Four guardians, four flames, standing proud in a line. The first, to light his fire, dared not march on the end. The second, beside the first, played a woeful lament. The third kept close to his faithful beast. The fourth marched not beside the first, yet like the second played a tune. And thus they stood o'er their queen, who slept beneath flickering stars. This is actually pretty tough. Because I was listening out for, for the mentioning dogs, because there's a dog there, but he's also got the tune. What was that inscription again? Right. Four guardians, four flames, standing proud in a line. The first, to light his fire, dared not march on the end. The second, beside the first, played a woeful lament. The third kept close to his faithful beast. The fourth marched not beside the first, yet like the second played a tune. And thus they stood o'er their queen, who slept beneath flickering stars. I wish we could keep the text on the screen. What was that inscription again? Four guardians, four right. flames, standing proud in a line. The first, to light his fire, dared not march I don't know end. who the first is. The second, beside the first, played a woeful lament. The third kept close to his faithful beast. The fourth marched not beside the first, yet like the second played a tune. Right. And thus they okay. stood over their queen, who slept so. with flickering stars. The first has got to be someone without a dog or a or a thing, doesn't it? Right. So we'll go with him being the first. What was that inscription again? So the four second played a tune, didn't he? Flames, standing proud in a line. First light his fire dared not march first, on the end. To light his fire dared not march on the end. The second, beside the first, played a woeful lament. The third kept close to his faithful beast. The fourth marched not beside the first, yet like the second played a tune. And thus they stood o'er their queen, who slept beneath flickering stars. Right, okay. So, I've got no idea if I'm honest. We'll go with a dog and tune. No, that's wrong. That's fine. In fact, I think we're just going to have to brute force this. Oh, we're wait there. But does that mean this was definitely right? Seems we did something wrong. Aha, uh -huh. okay, so it's not him. It's got to be... This one. Let's try it. Just got to figure out the order. Four. Wait. Something just happened. Mm-hmm. Behind that wall, a movement. See, that's right. What was so how we need to work the third one? Four guardians, four flames, standing proud. Did the third one play a tune? The first, to light his fire, dared not march on the end. The second, beside the first, played a woeful lament. Excellent. The third kept close to his faithful beast. The fourth marched not beside the first, yet like the second played a tune. It is, it's this one, because he doesn't thus, play a they tune. stood over their queen, who slept beneath flickering stars. Boom, boom. There we go. Awesome. You just had to pick, basically, pick a one that you could start with and then go from there. I don't really think you could just figure it out instantly from that riddle. Well, maybe you can, but I'm not clever enough to do that. I need a good few tries. Looks like some elven sanctuary. Whose grave is it? What do you think? No inscription, sadly. Hmm. Sign of the gull. If I didn't already know where she was buried. I guess this is Laura Doran's sepulchre. Perhaps it's a monument to her. Can't see the elves commemorating her this way. Heroine of a tragic legend to some, but... Most see her as a traitor to her race, who got her just desserts for marrying Kragenin of Laud. Perhaps the elven mage is Lara's kin. It would explain why he's helping Ciri. Possible. This what you're looking for? Uh-huh. So what's it supposed to do? Hmm. I 
hope I'll be able to activate it. Let's leave this place, shall we? Oh, well, that was a lot shorter. That was a lot of a short, shorter quest than I thought it was going to be. Sage's Note. Let's have a look. Calvary Trousers. Day 3275. Damn. Final conclusions regarding the lamp. My experiences with magic lamp unequivocally confirm that by using it activates centers of condensed spiritual energy can be coaxed into contact and communicate a limited set of the being's last memories. Laura Doran's remains, however, emit entirely inert spiritual energy despite the violent conditions of her death, which should have strengthened the desired tendency. Laura remains silent. At this point, further research on lamps enabling control con contact with the dead seem entirely, entirely useless for my purposes. Up here. Hmm. Oh, we've got a place of power, baby. A place of power. And a beast. Give me this quick. Nice. This will actually come in handy with that monster because slowdown works really, really well. Quen. Yurden. Damn it. Come on, baby. Oh, it's getting ruined. Oh, it's pretty tough, actually. Shit. Oh, I, I, I did it at the wrong time there. Motherfucker. I like her staggers. Half health. Give me a quen. Get him. Wait for it. Oh, we got us. Let's try the heavy attack. I think the heavy attacks are going through his armor a lot better. Get wrecked. Nothing here. Or oh, look at that chest. Silver ore, awesome. Sheerdal's armor and the golden aureole. Oh, we got a door. Shazam! Can't get through there. Is that it? I think that is actually it. Dead guy. Okay, what do we get from there? Oh, we've got lots of stuff. Look at that. That is amazing. Plus seven extra armor, we'll take that. That's not good. That's not good. Some gauntlets, three armor. So it's the same. Oh, we actually found the assassin's gauntlets. Burning, slash, and bludgeoning. Amazing. Plus ten critical hit chance. Top tier. 
plus 24 armor. It just looks terrible. Got some good loot there. What about swords? That sword is good, but again, we don't get the experience, so I'm, I'm going to hold off on using it. Yeah, that was well worthwhile. Go on, baby. Let's go. Hmm. Magic. A place of power. So which way was it out? It was the opposite way, wasn't it? Yeah, this way. We going? Come mm. on, Kira. I can't actually get up the stairs. Oh, there we go. <laughs> For some reason, he couldn't navigate a step. There's something here. Need to use the eye. Shazam! What the hell was that noise? Last. But it was worth it, right? You learned something about Siri in the end. Something important. Do you intend to venture into Crookback Bog? You must tell me about it afterwards. Don't know that I'll get the chance. Geralt, there are two types of men. Those who see opportunity and take advantage, and those who forge the opportunities themselves. I've always seen you as an example of the latter. Besides, I've a favour to ask you. So, visit me sometime? Definitely. I'll stop by. You can be sure. <laughs> In that case, I shall be waiting. Yeah, baby. See you, Kira. So is she just going to reside at her re regular residence as the, the town herbalist? Let's go. I was, I, was trying, I was trying to follow her in. Excellent. So that's another quest done. That was a really good quest. Where are we? Oh, damn. Where the f... We are miles away. That must be the entrance. Okay, tell you what we'll do. We'll quickly go here. And then I'm going to head down south to this and I'll visit these towns if not for anything other than to get the fast travel points. Roach, an invitation from Kira Metz. Let's have a look at our quests. So, Bloody Baron's level 6, so that's good. Ladies of the Woods level 6. Destination Skellige. Second request, Wild at Heart. Talk to the Hunter. He's got to be close actually. He's, 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 he's nothing short of being the furthest away possible. Okay. Where is she? I think it's the same town, isn't it? I think we'll go and see her eventually. Right, enough of that. We're going to go north to that. Roach? Oh, we're going to get a sunrise soon. Come on then, charge! So our character, we got, we've got two points available. What I think we should do is we should spend the point in next level. Maintaining an active shield no longer drains stamina. Stamina drains unchanged. Damage absorbed with the shield restore vitality. I'll boost this up and then I think we're going to go. I'm going to start putting points into combat, but not yet. Because we can't actually utilise it. Because we don't have any skill trees unlocked. Unlocked at level 6. I'll hold it to this point until level 6. Slow now. Hidden treasure. This could be difficult, actually. Oops, wrong. Level 13! Fuck me. 
Hey, you drive all this, lads. Can we damage these? Right, let me just get Quinn off. Let me get the slow motion, because I don't think we can damage them until we, we hit them with the area effect. Right, here we go. Wraith? Oh, no, it's too far away. Come on then. One. Come on, baby. This one doesn't give a fuck, does it? Not fucking about. These guys are just taking a fucking piss now, like. Oh, the health regen is amazing. Let's go up here. Because these guys aren't like engaging in combat properly, they're taking a piss. We've really got them down, we'll kill these guys. Well, if I was prepared. Shit the bed. These guys are too fucking difficult, like. I need to be somewhere where I can actually see. I hate fighting on a hill. Motherfucking bitch. Got us in a sneak attack. There's no way of doing it. Well, I can do this. Let's just get this one by itself. Come here. Why are you running? Where's the one with no health? This one, fuck you. Motherfuckers, I swear down these cunts. Right, got one, got one, got one, got one. We seriously need to do more damage, like. Twenty-eight 
twat. Groups of enemies are a nightmare. Come on, you're going down to Chinatown, you. Get wrecked, that's another one down. Couple more to go. These guys are taking a piss, aren't they? Don't run! Oh, don't! No, this is it. I've come too far. If I die here, I'll fucking cry. Oh, no way! Bruh. Bro. Bro, can you believe that? Can you actually believe that? I got stun locked from fucking nowhere. Died. Unreal. Even though I had Quen with stone health. Fuck. Okay, I did try this. They're like double R level. Let's let's never make that mistake again. The allied bitches. Oh fuck it. Yeah, wait there. Sorry, I've got. I've, I, I'm just too stubborn. Fight me here! Scared? The treasure's inside. Show me what you got. A noon wraith at night. That was bullshit. That, that move that she does is brutal. Huh? Did she just fuck... Uh, they, they, these enemies are dog shit like. I know you're there. What now, you piece of filth? Did you just get full health? Fuck this. What a waste of fucking time. Where's the treasure? Oh, we already picked up the treasure. There's more treasure here, apparently. Below us. Aha! We got an unsent letter. Thank the gods. Fools believe in them. We've made good use of the fact twice now. Stole a load of silver. We'll spend the night in the woods, then we'll write to Novigrad. Find a buyer for the whole stash. We won't play with the goods. I think I actually managed to steal them right out from one of their noses. Let's fucking get out of here. Hideous. Right, let's never ever do that again. <laughs> it's just a waste of time. Okay, where was I headed? I want to go to this. Well, we'll stop off in this city. And then we'll go to this one. Hopefully we get a fast travel point. Hey yeah. Hey yeah. Let's ride. We are really high up here. Ah, we're here. And it's not a city. Ah, 
how hard are these guys going to be? <clears throat> Mystery of the Bioweirs. What level is he? Question. This guy's a questionable level, which means we are offing and fucking. Fucking right off. Bioweirs, we've got the fast travel point though. Get here. Yeah, these are like the no man's lands. Have we ever seen a hospitable town yet? This is more my style. Level 7 rates. This is something we can work with. Beautiful. No. That's more like it. Good shit. Yeah. This could be a town actually, it looks like it's got a dock. Roach? What you <laughs> the Roach was hiding in a tree, he was like I am fucking with no ghosts, to mine. Move it. Roach is not about that afterlife. Abandoned site. Deserters. Oh my days, there's a lot of them. No, I don't want to be on the horse. Not the horse, please. Off the horse. Today, please. Thank you. Press the wrong button. These guys are fast. Not too late to surrender. Come on, parry. Go on, hit. Get wrecked. Oh, I love a good parry. Come on, deserter. Oh, he was fast. That running attack's really fast. I love the parry system. Oh, I got him. Oh, I got him from behind him. That's exactly what he gets. Decapitation. There's more enemies here. So let's be sensible. Oh, he's an archer. He's dead. Surrender. <laughs> Ain't a big, big bollocks, do you? Oh, come on! You're dead. Oh, beautiful! Look at the skills. Light and the heavy is really good because light covers distance really well. Right, there's another guy over there. Hello, fellow. Oh, you're dead. Archer. Did he just poison me? Oh, no, this sort. 
This sword has a chance to poison, doesn't it? That's what that was. Last one. There's one more guy. Bad idea. <laughs> the legs are still walking. The legs were still walking. Perfect. 50 crowns. It's good money for, for liberating these places. There's also a merchant. Let's see if they've got anything good. good I tell you. Where'd you come from? Oi oi! Greetings. Wouldn't mind a look at your stock. These merchants don't actually sell anything good. Well, not that I've found anyway. It's crazy how these swords are worth nothing. I think I might just... Uh, um. That sells for quite a lot. I think I might just... Um, dis dismember? It's not dismember, oh, well. dismantle. I think we might just dismantle them. Said a hag to a hag. I'll shovel reef right up your cunt. Oh, that's a nice, nice lady. She said, I want to shove it up your cunt. Obviously, not to me, because we would kill her. I want to see what's in the dock. Oh, is this house dead? Oh, no, it's alive. Right, where to next? We've cleared that we've been there, we've been there. No, surprise there's no fast travel point here, that's a bit shady. I think it would be rude not to go here. I'll tell you why, there's got to be a fast travel point on the way there. Yeah, and we, we can go to this area because we've got fast travel points above and below it. We'll head this way. I feel like exploring. Come on, Roach. It's an adventure. What's the rush? Matter where the grub's from, but I'll buy the team. Nice little course run. I think that's one. It is nice to have massive open areas, but sometimes because Damn your sense of exploration gets the best of you, you like tend to put off quests, but it does benefit you in the long run. Hold on. Quests. Oh good, I thought that might have been the main quest, which I don't want to do actually, but we'll have a look here. This does not look hospitable at all. Guarded treasure. Rish Glow. What's it guarded by? Anything hard? Oh yeah, fuck this. See you bitch. We did get a fast travel point though, which is all we wanted. Okay. I think. Place of haunting. Oh shit. Right, let's quickly get to that fast travel point. And we'll fast travel away from here. If we can remain covert. I'm not entirely sure we can. Boom, we did. <laughs> right, let's get back here.
We'll go here, we'll do a quest. We'll explore that area later on. It seems to be a much higher level than what we are, so there's no real point in doing it now. So, quests. An invitation from Kira Metz. Talk to Kira. We can do that. We can also do Wild at Heart. Tell you what, we'll go and see Kira. She's there, where's the other quest? Blackborough. So we're in... Okay, well, we can go here on the... Oh, we can ride there. Right, where's the front door? Take it easy. He's got loads of herbs. <laughs> she, <laughs> the house is so magic it doesn't have a front door. She has to teleport in. Is this it? Huh? Oh, here it is. The rats, why did he need them? Bloody rodents. Better to have stuffed them with a poison, or crushed them into a pulp with a shovel, but no. Did you see what he did with them? Who's she talking to? Kira, what are you doing? Geralt! <laughs> you gave me quite a start. But nay, the mage says bring me rats and healthy ones. Not something the cat drags in. This the lamp from the elf's hideout? And what's this about rats? Nothing important. I'll explain later. Now tell me, to what do I owe the pleasure? You told me to come see you. Let's see what she sells first. Bet the old witch who lived here left you a bunch of interesting sundries. She did indeed. I gather you'd like a look. Very much so. Oh my days, look at all the stuff she sells. Returns all ability points, so she's got a respect for a thousand. And she's got lots of diagrams. Formulas? Books? Okay, nothing that we, we really need at the minute. Why do you want the lamp? You just witnessed why. To communicate with lost souls. Didn't know you were interested in that kind of magic. There's nothing wrong with it. Mm -hmm. Why'd the elf promise you the lamp? We traded for it. He needed powerful magic and sensed I was no common wart charmer. I brewed him a potion. To delay nervous tissue degeneration, stave off memory loss or some such. Who do you want to use it on? He didn't say. So, bet you saw this question coming. What are you doing here? Let me think. Enjoying the country air? Admiring the unspoilt scenery? Or is it furthering the age-old alliance between the city and its breadbasket? No. I'm in hiding, Geralt. Blind to the state of the world? Don't you see what's happening? You mean the persecution mages now face? Yes, that's exactly what I mean. Radovid's new pastime. Pursuing anyone with a whiff of magic about them. Witch hunters. Sound familiar? Murderers scouring the north from end to end. Burning books, hanging soothsayers, torturing herbalists. Changing the subject. We've actually already had that conversation with her, haven't we? Any news of your sisters from the lodge? None. We can't know too much about one another these days. It's safer that way. Even tried to contact one another? I've wanted to many times. But I've no way of knowing who would answer. Or who might be listening. 
mentioned you wanted something from me. I did, and still do. The cursed isle on Lake Windama, you've heard of it, I'm sure. The local peasants mumble incessantly about it, about the wraiths that haunt it. They claim none who go there return. How did it come to be cursed? That's what I don't know. I must break this spell, yet I've been unable to identify its source. Gotta know something. Scraps. The curse is somehow linked to the tower where Serard, the lord of these lands, took refuge when Nilfgaard invaded. Claims in the village are that peasants, desperate of hunger, sailed to Fike Isle to beg for food. Met their end there. Fike. It's a massacre. So, will you please help me lift this curse? You're so good at these things. Come on then. Actually, yeah. Why do you want to lift the curse? Are you getting paid? Why are you so intent on this? I'm not. The local peasantry is. The Isle, miss. You've got to lift the charm. You're a good witch, a great witch. There's no <laughs> end to it. Uh -huh. See, I thought you didn't care for the locals. The great witch you are. I failed to lift the curse and they could conclude I'm not so great. Not enough to conceal me from the witch hunters and risk getting sent to the gallows themselves. What others think. Your image. That's all you care about. The point is, listen, I didn't flee to these wilds just to stupidly get caught because some boar with grit under his fingernails grows annoyed with me. I'll do it. All right, I'll help. I knew you'd find it irresistible. Naturally, you'll need to sail to Fike Isle. Fine. What then? Well, the spirits who wander the Isle, you must establish a rapport with them. Don't know how. But they could point us in the direction of the curse's source. Think they'll be willing to chat? Of course. Provided you take my magic lamp with you. I shall let you keep it afterwards in appreciation. You'll find it quite useful, I'm sure. Awesome. I'll have a magic lamp. Can we rub it and get three wishes? Oh shit, actually we shouldn't. Geralt, Geralt's already had that with the genie. That's not the type of magic lamp we want. Can't you just come with me? I tried to go to Fikeyer once. Thought my head would burst, the curse's magic was so strong. Nice of you to send me there. I experienced an acute nasal hemorrhage. You stand to endure a wobble of your medallion at most. At Aratusa, they trained me to detect even the subtlest magic pulses. This was like getting smacked across my haunches with a grain flail. Funny. Thought you'd go in for that sort of thing. Take my boat. I left it on the lake shore near the village. Should be fit to use. Provided rot hasn't eaten it, as it seems to eat everything here. Hmm. How's the lamp actually work? I mean, do I just rub it or do I have to do <laughs> something, um, magical? <laughs> you needn't even rub. Just place it where you find bones and hear whispers. Um, I suppose I should warn you. It might not be the most pleasant experience. Figured as much. Tell you all about it later. Maybe skip the drastic bits. You'll need to do neither. I'll give you a Xenovox. It's a bauble that will let us speak over some distance. You will tell me what you see, and I shall tell you what to do and look for. Xenovox. I need to know anything else More well before I go. No, that is all. Oh, go already. I can't wait to see what you discover on Fi Kyle. Just be sure to come and see me afterwards. And... Geralt. Mm hmm? Thank you. Excellent. Right. Fike Isle. Quests. This is a secondary quest, is it? A tower full of mice. Use Kira's boat to Fike Isle. Right, where is that? Just there. I wonder where Fike Isle is. Oh, that's it there. Very interesting. Okay, this is cool. How do we get out? Oh, she's got a basement. Oh yeah, we've already robbed this place, haven't we? <laughs> we robbed this the first time we went into a house. See you later. Roach, we're going on a boat. Maybe you're not. I don't think the boat's going to be big enough for you, but we'll try. I'll try and bring you, bruh. Roach, stop being a bitch.
There's a boat. Oh, and a nice well, hangman. Wait, how do we work? The, how do we how do we work the boat? Sail it. Ah, take the helm. Right, hold it, accelerate. Ah, that's pretty easy, you know. Oh, this is gorgeous. Look at this. The water's so lush. Is there anything good in the water? On the way? There's something there. Let's sail past it. Just so we can see. <laughs> We've got a boat. How good's this? Oh, we can do this level eight water hug. She's <laughs> she's running the ball like in it. She's crazy. She's fast. Not fast from enough for my blade. Heavy attacks are making light work of her life. Off with your head. Nilf Guardian Longsword. Actually probably the best thing from that chest was the silver ore we got. Feel like a real pirate. Just without the the plundering of other ships. Right, this island's pretty far away, like. Jeez. Geralt, can you hear me? How goes it? Where are you? Almost there. Splendid. I shall contact you again soon. Wait, this Xenovox. Can I contact you with it or is it one way? One way only, I'm afraid. You'll have to trust my feminine intuition. Your what? My feminine intuition! Wonderful. <laughs> oh, there's another boat there. These boats are marked on the map. Oh, look at this! It's going to be a proper tower. There's also a village there, so once we finish this quest, we can go north to the village and Probably get a fast travel point there. Happy days. Oh, what do we got? Drowners. Is this the island? It is. Rot fiends. Who's screaming? Don't tell me rot fiends make human scream noises. They do. That's hideous. Oh, we can sustain two. Oh, he exploded shit. Watch out. I forgot those guys do that. You Girl, played yourself. Are you on the aisle yet? Does this animal work? Can you hear me? 
What? I can't hear. Great, broke already. Sheesh, short-lived this magic. What did you say? There's some interference. You must be very careful. Yeah, are those screams with the with the Xenovox? What can hell? It was hideous. <coughs> oh, pardon me. More rot fiends. Wait, I've got something stuck in my throat. <coughs> oh, pardon me. Rot fiend gas stuck in my throat. Can we parry these guys? Oh, you can! I didn't realise you could parry monsters. At least we've just figured it out. Necrophage. Use the magic lamp to find ghosts. Oh, shit! How do we... Um. Optional, find ghosts. Okay. I don't know how to use the magic lamp. I imagine just once we're in the right place. What now, you piece of filth? Press the wrong button. Again, I press the wrong button again. There we go, parry drowners. Come here. Beautiful. <laughs> oh, we found something here. Nothing great. your nerve oh you can't parry that okay so what I've learned is that you can't parry 200 attacks you can't parry like heavy jumping attacks you can just parry regular ones like this or that and that one was a See, they're all jumping attacks then. Fuck me. Quinn killed him. <laughs> what is that? A ghoul. Can we parry ghouls? Come on, come close. Yes. Oh lads, I'm a parry monster. I love the combat. And I've noticed as well, when you do parry an enemy, you do a little bit of damage on the riposte. And then you can obviously attack afterwards. That's pretty cool. I wonder if there's any like uh, skills directly relating to the the parries. Oh shit! That was a heavy attack. Oops. Keep pressing the wrong button. I don't know why I keep pressing like L1 for the the repost, but it's not. That's it. That's him dead. All of his mates are dead. Apart from him. Come on. Oh shit. Oh 
Oh, who's after us? Are those enemies? Oh, this guy is. They are pretty disgusting creatures, to be fair. Right, we're getting close to it now. I wonder what the the bees are for. Do they signify anything or? Oh, you can't do stuff with it. You can loot it. That's pretty cool. I'll tell you what I'm going to do, lads. I want to call an episode here. When we come back, we'll continue this quest, the towel full of mice. It's going to be awesome. We'll try and use the magic lamp to find ghosts first, see if we can commune with the dead, and then we'll head for the tower. Hope you enjoyed the episode, lads. See you in the next one.